Now we're ready to start. Okay, sorry about that. So starting with, it's hip rotation, so we're supposed to be just rotating our hips side to side for 30, for the for 60 seconds or a minute. We're gonna start with this this way. Then we're gonna add in some more upper body. So hip, twisting it side to side. We're warming it up. Come on, hip, twist. Have some fun with it, come on. You twist it out, twist it out. We have the right music, it would be better. This is not the right music for it. <laughs> Let's do the twist. Everybody like this. <laughs> okay, anyways, I'm being goofy. All right. Twist out the hips. Come on. A second here, we're going to start with the upper body and keep the hips stationary. All right, here. Oh, okay, here we go. There we go. We're twisting. Ready for upper body hip twist? Up, stationary, and twist. Lower body, stay still. Working the core just a little bit, warming it up. We're going to be doing side bend with hands on the hips. Then side bend for the foot reach, reaching over to the foot, okay? And then we're going to be going into twisting to the side while standing all the way over like that. We're going to do a, a back bend at the top of the mat into warrior three and a warrior three touch down to the mat. All right, coming back and doing it on the other side. Starts in 15 seconds. Keep on twisting, warming up the body. Actually, we're already warm from doing everything else today. Let's twist it out. Start at the top here. Okay, so side bends, gentle side bends, side hands on hips, tilt it over to the side. Hands are on hips, and we're just leaning over just a little bit. Just gentle side bend, stretching it out just a little bit. Go until you feel it. Next one's gonna be like, we're gonna step our legs out. We're gonna come all the way down, kind of like a windmill, whatever way you wanna do it though. Hold that stretch right there, feel it stretching. Step it out, and Touch the toe. Keep it to the side though. Come on. Lift up that upper arm back. Pull the arm upper arm back. Straight that side. Come on. Stretch it out. We're going to this one. To the twist. To the side. Hearts up. Twist it over, hand on the hip, on the side, pull. So my hand is on my side, pulling. Pull it back. Give that really good twist in that back. Hold it. Off the mat. Gentle back. Doing these in the 20 second. 20 seconds is what they say. You should hold a stretch for it. Hold it back there, come on. Push your belly forward. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go into warrior three next. It's supposed to be gentle back then. So we're supposed to be doing like this. Gentle. Not all crazy like. All right, warrior. Three. Come on. Ah. You gotta remember that I did this with my, I did right with everything, but then I did my left foot forward for the first warrior. Okay, regroup for a second. Warrior three. Touch to the ground, hold that leg up. Pull your head in. Top of the mat, lean on the other side next. Pull the body up, come on. Pull that leg up. Come on. 
Come on down. Step it up. And we're stretching it to the side. Make sure we're together for this one. Feel that stretch. Just a gentle stretch. All stretches don't have to be all crazy like. Step it out and do it more like windmill style. After this one, just remember, pull that upper arm back. Keep that stretch. Feel it really good on your side, okay? Step it out. Arms, windmill it down. Touch it. Pull that tall arm back. We're going to our twist next after this one. Twisting it to the other side. Come on. Hold it in there. Come on up, hand comes on this hip, and we twist, actually, it doesn't feel right. Is that what I did? I guess it is. Pull it back. It is what I did. It just feels over. Come on. Going from this one to the back bend. back and let's try to keep it a little bit more simple for gentle back bend okay come on just pull it up a little bit minutes I know we're calories 565 calories heart rate 109 beats per minute warrior three Seven and four with the right foot this time. I did it right. And coming on up. Holding it. Whoa. Thought I was holding it. Get that focus. Come on. Tighten that core. Find your focus. Come on in, regroup, same thing, pull the way down. All the way down. Okay, so after this one, we're gonna come in, we're gonna do tree. Come on up, come on in, tree. Since we're in balances, I figured why not add some more balances to it, right? Tree, hands wherever you want to. I gotta remember I had foot part first part, straight out, get my balance, and then came into the dips. For the other side, this is where we're going next, right? Tree can also move your hands straight up in the air, like this, that's where you're really supposed to do it. But that's not what I did. Other leg again. Put your balance. Either put your hands up in the air, like it has in there, or just come to the hips. Either way, I do have to do what I do on the other side. That's where I am. So, very end, I fold them up like you're supposed to do, but I balance it out. Come on. Okay, so we're going to do. Quad stretch, pull it up. Ooh, that's a tight quad. You can be in the car for a bit today, you can stretch it out. Hold it up there, go to the other leg. leg, stretch it out, get in there really good, come on, hold it up there, I guess I did 25 second ones, I thought I did 20, or 25 second ones, <laughs> for the five second transition, woo, sound effects are much, very much so, come on, hold it in there, 
Over the top of the mat. Walk it out to the top of the plank. Hold that plank. Three, two, one. Lower yourself down. Come on up. Lower yourself down. Top of the plank. Push it back. And we're done. Dive bomb it down into outward dog. Curl those toes back into downward dog. Come on up, dive bomb it down, upward dog. That was a weak dive, but oh well. All right, all the way to the mat. Arm is out. You know, I'm gonna do this one. Ah, shoulders are tight from everything. All the work we've been doing. Yeah, let's break it out. And take it to the other side. Come on up. All fours. Cat it. How it. Cat it. Back means it. This is because the back needs the stretch from working it out today. One more time down, roll those toes under, all the way up, push it back. Walk them back, forward fold it, halfway lift it, forward fold it, all the way up. So, so different stretches, but needed, looking at what was on schedule, then thinking we got to the balances, why not add some more? I had to get a few stretches in there for the back. I know that always looked funny, but I want to get them in there because I'm working the back out today. I needed it, plus I'm sitting in a car, so I didn't really need it. So today is checking it off, saying we're done. I'll be offline tomorrow, but that doesn't mean be lazy. Keep on checking it off and getting it done.